Welcome everybody, Red Arrow 23 here. Today we're going to show Angry G Vibe's first attempt at Hardcore, the new operation base. Let's boom some booches! Alright, let's check it out. The first attack we've got is by E Dog. You can see his details there. Let's get into it. So this is the base hardcore. As you can see, there's a couple of shield generators here um, that we're going to have to deal with. A little bit of barbed wire. Um, just in here. And a few rocket launchers, a few grapplers. So let's get into it, see how we did it. So e dog starts off just clearing some mines. As we know, the Zookas don't really like mines don't have enough health to tank them so here we go a little smoky landing and we're going straight in straight through the barbed wire using that med kit and he's using one two three four five boats of zookas gets his shocks off takes out those rocket launchers i think that was the main job there for those boats nice work and dumps his other three over in the corner. And he's just using Bart to take out um, these two rocket launchers down at 6.30. So nice, clearing out some cells, taking out some GBE. Well, building up his GBE again. And now the next target, I believe, is this rocket launcher up here. So it's nice, already done some damage to it. If he doesn't take it out, it'll be an easy finish for the next guy. He's obviously running out of GBE by now. He's coming in range of this rocket launcher as well. So there we go. Nice attack by e Dog. Took out a bunch of rocket launchers. Cleared some mines. Went through some barbed wire. There we go. So next attack is McAllen, aka Pinhe. Let's check out what he's got to do. There we go. Rocket launcher out as advertised soon i thought he was going to take it out there we go boom down and he's obviously going up here towards this machine gun i think the reason he's taking this out is so that he can shock that entire section without having to worry about two shocking so he's taking out the extra machine gun there nice let's speed up the walk nice tight grouping with his eight boats of zookas i like it it's the smoke even though they're spreading a little bit and here we go so half of them were picked a little bit early and they got wiped out so it's unfortunate if we laid those last two smokes at the same time that might have been a different story nice took out that rocket launcher probably didn't need a shock there but that's okay let's keep it moving Grappler's just picking them off a little bit. Now he's just going to move in, try and take a few out of them out. At least now that he's taken that grappler out, there's a bit of room in there for some zookas to creep through, maybe for the next attack. So the main objective of this um, that we're trying to work towards is clearing out a spot at 8 o'clock. Um, 8 o'clock being down here. So nice, look at them, still going, still shocking. Getting rid of these mortars as well. I like it. Gotta watch out putting the critters between you and the laser. Make sure you don't lure it on. And there we go. Taking out a decent section. I like it. Nice work, Pinhe. And let's check out Doof. Doof's up next. Doof and Schmirks. Believe is a children's cartoon character. And then same thing again, we're not planning on bringing our Zookas way up to the top there, so let's get some Bart on that, take it out, boom, gone. Let's bring some Zookas into the place, so just using the one smoke to avoid this rocket launcher here. Nice, we can see that range. And then using the same path coming up this left side. Gathers them up. Straight through the gate. 
Use the band-aid to get rid of the uh, cuts for the zookas. Nice, a little bit of ointment, good to go. <laughs> Look at this grappler up top, just trolling. All the hot pots popping up and down. <laughs> Crack up. Alright, so he moves down a little bit further. Still using the critters to um, distract that laser. Because that would be pretty brutal if it got onto him. And he wants to take out these grapplers because if we um because of the amount of shield generators we want a free spot where we're not going to be hassled by anything because even if it's just one grappler it'll keep picking them off um quite a lot and then you end up with not many zukus and you're trying to finish it off nice just dodge that laser as close doof so I don't, I don't, I think Doof wanted to take out a few more shield generators, but he's done an awesome job clearing out those grapplers, the rocket launcher up top, clearing out a bunch of defenses. So it's almost uncontested from the 8 o'clock position now. So nice work Doof, clearing it up. And he was left with three Zugas, I think. Yep, three Zugas. And then who we got next? We got Long Van. AKA Mac Attack. This is the account with um, 6 TD statues. Because he's crazy like that. So here we go. Nice grouping using the corner to group them all up. Not too worried because he's not having to smoke at the moment. There we go. He's going right up top. Wants to get rid of these grapplers and all the defenses around it while he's there nice grapplers are gone so he kind of wants to group them up before he goes through the barbed wire he's going to have to use two medkits so that's nice and taking out shield generators is obviously helping um, it just kills a bunch of health on the core without having to just grind it down like he is now so the critters aren't working because the grapplers are just pulling them away but that's all good because the main Zookas are doing the damage. And I believe he left at the end of this attack, there was 8 mil, 8 mil health on it. So if there's 8 mil on the, on the shield and core combined, there must be a ton of health on with all the shields there. And then look at this, Red Arrow 23 swooping in for the unboosted finish. Jumping on it, taking one for the team, not being able to use his boost. I hate taking these ones because I feel like I'm letting the team down but not boosting. Don't like trying to save powder. But why use powder when you don't have to? So let's have a look. Didn't want to use too many flares, so did flag landing and then ended up having to group them all up. It's okay. There we go, flare the core from a little bit further away so we don't stack up too much. And then I'm shocking the grappler because I saw the grappler turn and I knew it was going to turn um, for at least one of the zookas. So I'm just going to try and keep that grappler um, shocked for as long as I can. And we're going to four times this. So just trying to keep it shocked. And then I think I eventually run out of GBE and it just picks off a couple of the girls. Just picks a few of them off. And then it gets to the point where there's none in range. So we just grind it down. So great assist from all the rest of the guys. I came in for the easy finish. Triple med kit. Triple gangster. I like it. So there's hardcore down in five hits. That's all I got for you guys today. Comment down below how you've been finding the new maps. Um, whether you've attacked hardcore or not. And give us a thumbs up if you liked the video. Thumbs down if you didn't. And subscribe for more. Boo boo!